All right, let's get started. Today we're going to talk about something that uh, is a pretty popular common story, but we're going to take a little bit of a detour and talk about it from a slightly different perspective that I'm calling strong and fragile. So this is the story of Lazarus, and I'm not going to tell you the whole story because most of you know it, but I'm going to tell you a piece of it, okay? Here we go, John chapter 11. On his arrival, Jesus found that Lazarus had already been dead in the tomb for four days. And many Jews had come to Martha and Mary to comfort them in the loss of their brother. When Martha heard that Jesus was coming, she went out to meet him, but Mary stayed home. Lord, Martha said to Jesus, if you had been here, my brother would not have died. But I know that now, even now, God will give you whatever you ask. Jesus said to her, your brother will rise again. Martha answered, I know he will rise again in the resurrection at the last day. Jesus said to her, I am the resurrection and the life. The one who believes in me will live even though they die. And whoever lives by believing in me will never die. Do you believe this? Yes, Lord, she replied. I believe that you are the Messiah, the Son of God, who has come into the world. After she had said this, she went back and called her sister Mary aside. The teacher is here, she said, and is asking for you. When Mary reached the place where Jesus was and saw him, she fell at his feet and said, Lord, if you had been here, my brother would not have died. When Jesus saw her weeping, and the Jews who had come along with her also weeping, he was deeply moved in spirit and troubled. Jesus wept. Then the Jews said, See how much he loved him? Let's pray. Father, um, it is hard to read the familiar and hear it because it's familiar. But your word is never familiar to us. It's never a common thing, and it's never easy. So we pray this morning as we look at this story that you would help us to see the strong and the fragile. Help us to see Jesus one more time, maybe from a perspective we've never seen him before. Help us to learn something new, but more than learn in our head, help us to have a heart that is changed by your word and by your person. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Check this out. 